Hello, friends. Last week we did a reaction to Motherless Child, performed by Prince. And a lot of you in the feedback in the comments section said, well, it's actually a Richie Haven song. And I did a little bit of research and I, I saw Richie Haven, uh, the performance of him at Woodstock. No, I wasn't there personally. I'm old, but I'm not that old. Anyway, I watched it and as soon as I heard the song, I'm like, oh, okay, I remember this now. So what we're going to do is I found a version of him playing it live in 2009. So we are going to check that out. I, I'm surprised Richie Havens, is he even still alive now? But uh, even to see him do that in 2009, you know, he looked like he was a little older in 69. So now to see him perform it in 2009, that's, that kind of shocked me. So let's check it out. I'm aware of the song now. And uh, let's see what's going on. He has an unorthodox way. He plays some of the chords. I remember that from watching him at uh, Woodstock. Remember, I was not there. <laughs> Where he uses his thumb to come up and over to play some of the lower strings. I do remember seeing, noticing that, watching him back in the video of him playing in 69. So let's check it out. Great rhythm hand with the strumming, eh? Really laying down a great rhythm right there. Freedom, 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 freedom. So he, he, to be able to do that with his thumb, he, he would have had a bit of a different tuning on the low uh, strings. Really great right hand for his strumming. Really cool. He's got the conga there. Uh, for the rhythm, that's cool. He's got a really, really nice uh, company and guitar player. So that would have been a cool gig to have been at. You notice that the accompanying guitar player too, he's, he's throwing in some pentatonic licks there. You know, Richie Havens here, he's the attraction, okay? He's keeping his phrasing really nice, simple, juicy, juicy, but yet tasteful, and he's playing around Richie with this, okay? He's not, sometimes you see some people that are just, interesting sense of dynamics. This is phenomenal. I'm really liking this. Uh, he is playing with Richie, not kind of, you know, I've seen that sometimes in bands when people are, you know, ripping guitar solos when, when, when it's going against the dynamics and it's not working or they're not being respectful of the person who's singing or talking or whatever, right? So uh, this is really great. I really like this. I wonder where this was. I would have liked to have been there. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm really liking that with the rhythm section, for sure. Plan to go guitar. I really like his playing with rhythmically with what he's doing with to Richie Haven's rhythm. And he's just, he's complimenting. He's adding to it. He's playing along with the story. He's not you know, trying to step on his feet or anything with his playing, throwing in blistering licks or anything. This guy's great. He's playing the pentatonic scale, he's playing some licks in there, but he's using them more so in a rhythmic context to go with what Richie's doing, and it, and it really works. It really sounds great. Okay, I guess that's it. Oh. Woodstock 40. Okay. So that was like a 40th anniversary of Woodstock thing, maybe? Uh, you know, guys, I don't know, again, having been a, a young metalhead... Uh, and an angrier person when I was younger, age has a funny thing of doing things to you. You know, people might say, well, as you start to uh, lose things physically, you start to be imparted with wisdom and experience in life. I would not have, you know, I remember watching Richie Haven's back. I remember watching the whole Woodstock movie many times when I was younger. I didn't get a lot of the performances. I was like, oh my God, like, you know, all oh, those amps suck or this or that. <laughs> like, you know, it's really much older technology. Music's come a long way. I wouldn't have gotten it. I remember watching play. I mean, obviously I knew he could play and sing, but I, I just didn't get it. But now I can watch that and say, man, that was freaking awesome. And I love the accompaniment. He, keep, he kept it simple with the guy with the conga. Uh, and uh, the guy playing lead with him was absolutely amazing. Perfectly compl complimented him with the, the song. So I guess that is where Prince... Uh, that w would have been the version of that song that Prince would have been exposed to and then he made a cover of it which was fantastic but uh, I I'm going to check right now is Rich Haven still alive? How old is he? Let's see Richie Havens oh oh no so sad Okay, that was in 2009. That was, I guess, the Woodstock 40th anniversary. Uh, he passed away, very sadly, in April of 2013. He was 72. Very sad. But that, uh, that was an amazing performance. Um, thoughts go out to him. I uh, really enjoyed that. Really amazing performance. So, uh, great. The rhythm he was doing with his right hand. That was amazing. That was awesome. So that's Richie Haven, uh, Motherless Child, I guess. That was his version of that song, and uh, it was awesome, and it influenced Prince. All right. Keep the comments and suggestions coming. Remember, practice hard, practice smart, and we'll see you soon.